Coilies. Erica here from Coils and Curls. Welcome back to another Frizz Free Friday. Today we are trying three new products that I got from InnerSense Organic Beauty. These are three that I didn't get previously from the company, so I bought these myself. These three are perfect for this time of year. My skin has felt really itchy, my scalp was itchy, and my skin feels so dry. First I tried the True Enlightenment Scalp Scrub. Then I shampooed that out with their Hydrating Cream Hair Bath. Then I deep conditioned with their Hydrating Hair Mask. All of these are perfect for this time of year and I'm gonna go through them one by one. Now, the scrub is a pre-shampoo treatment. So what you're going to do is you're gonna wet your hair down and then you take a quarter size scoop and then you massage it into the scalp. From last week's video, we know we never go in circles for a curly. We go in straight lines, back and forth. After you rinse out the True Enlightenment scrub, you're going to shampoo it out with one of the appropriate hair baths for your hair type. Pure, if you have fine hair. The Color Awakening, if you have medium hair. Or the Hydrating Cream Bath, if you have very dry, thirsty hair. the ingredients that are inside the scrub are Hawaiian red salt. Now everyone's heard of Himalayan pink salt. Well now they have Hawaiian red and black salt. This red salt has iron rich volcanic clay in it and this clay contains over 80 natural minerals in it. The nutrients in this unrefined sea salt are easily absorbed through the skin which makes for a healthy happy scalp. So it turns out that pink, red, and black salt are not only better for your body, but they're better for your skin. Next is apple fruit extract, which is high in magnesium, potassium, copper, and calcium. This is why it's excellent for reducing hair loss and shedding because it's nourishing the hair follicles. They also include peppermint oil, which is the base fragrance for the scrub is excellent for stimulating blood flow, and when you stimulate blood flow, you're bringing nutrients to the area. It also includes celery seed, green tea, and tea tree oil. All of these help with inflammation and irritation. The instructions are, as I showed you, you take a quarter size scoop, you rub it in between your fingertips, and then you apply to the scalp, scrubbing in one direction, my curlies, one direction. When I was scrubbing this into the scalp, I definitely felt that tingle of peppermint. Now I scrubbed until I felt most of the salt gone because it's very gritty in the beginning. You definitely feel it. Then I rinsed that out completely while I scrubbed the scalp to make sure any salt wasn't left over and sitting there in between my hair. After rinsing out the scrub, I used the Hydrating Cream Hair Bath. They describe this as a luxurious hydrating shampoo for thick, coarse and thirsty hair. This hair bath helps to restore and nourish the hair using nourishing emollients that help soften and smooth your hair texture. Now they do this with the apple fruit extract, which we already went over. They also use shea butter, which is also known as mother nature's conditioner. My daughter used to call me mother nature. I kind of miss that, but I digress. The shea butter, which is great for dry and brittle hair. It's a fantabulous sealant for the hair shaft this way, moisture does not escape. It locks it in and then it prevents frizz and flyaways. Whee! <laughs> Building blocks to healthy hair are monounsaturated fats, protein, copper, folic acid, and magnesium. Now, all of these are found in avocado oil. Because avocado oil is so easily absorbed by the skin and the hair, it makes it perfect to put it into ingredients for hair that is dry, brittle, and thirsty. It helps give the hair amazing shine while it helps damage from chemical services. I'm starting to think that the next carrier oil for my hair loss serum that I make, I'm thinking it's gonna be the avocado oil. Next ingredient that's important is sage. Now, the base fragrance for the hair bath is sage and vanilla. So that's why the sage is here, but it also does something very important for our hair and our scalp. The sage stimulates circulation in the scalp, which encourages new hair growth and provides more nutrition to the hair follicle. 
I'm loving what they put in the products. The last ingredient I want to talk about is Tamanu oil. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. Tamanu oil is one of those long forgotten topical healing oils. I mean, let's face it, most of us are really trying to move back to all of these natural herbs that have been around for centuries. But I digress. It's full of antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, and antioxidant benefits. It's also an analgesic with anti-itching properties, which makes it perfect for dry, itchy scalps that have dandruff or flaking, and it even helps with some psoriasis symptoms. The last of the new products that I used today is the Hydrating Hair Mask. This helps repair, revitalize, and strengthen dry, coarse, and damaged hair. Now, a couple of things that the hair mask has in it that we've already talked about. It has the apple fruit extract. It also has the shea butter, the tamanu oil, as well as coconut oil. Coconut oil is one of those fatty acids that binds to proteins in the hair because the hair is made up of protein called keratin. So that's what makes the coconut oil super helpful. It helps prevent breakage and really helps seal in the moisture. It also helps reduce hygral fatigue. The hygral fatigue is when the hair expands with moisture and then shrinks and expands and shrinks or it's kept with too much moisture and stays expanded. That can create hygral fatigue, which makes your hair feel super dry. It also contains flaxseed and quinoa. Now, flaxseed is super high in omega-3s. It nourishes the follicles and encourages new healthy hair growth. One thing I did forget to mention were the positive affirmations that belong to each of these products. The True Enlightenment Scalp Scrubs positive affirmation is inside their box. It's not on their package. And that positive affirmation is, I now discover how wonderful I am. You have to keep the box top if you want to remember the positive affirmation. Unless most people remember the positive affirmations and I'm the only one who forgets. The positive affirmation for the hydrating cream hair bath is, I am in harmony with the flow of life. And last but not least, the hydrating hair mask. I am healthy and my hair shines bright. I'm going to use two of the Inner Sense Organic Beauty styling aids today. One of my subscribers who recently saw the video that I did for I Create Lift, the volumizing foam, and the uh, Serenity Smoothing Cream. Now, because I had used both of these on either side of my head, she said, have you thought of layering them? Using the Serenity Smoothing Cream first, and then using the I Create Lift on top. She said about scrunching out with a microfiber towel the excess water and product. To me, I don't like doing that because I feel like I'm wasting product and I'm cheap. Gotta be real, gotta be honest, I am cheap. <laughs> so this is what we're gonna do today. I am going to take the advice of my subscriber, thank you so much, and we are going to do that today. I am going to wet my head again for the fifth, sixth, seventh time. We are going to apply the Serenity Smoothing Cream. I do believe this was the pea size amount. Oh, this was the small amount. The longer your hair gets, the more product you are going to need. I am starting with this. Yes, my subscriber, it is probably a lot more than you had suggested. It's about the size of a, two teaspoons? Yeah, maybe a teaspoon and a half. I really feel like it's more like a teaspoon and a half. So I'm going to emulsify. Now, because I do want to get it near the scalp, because I don't want frizz at my scalp, I'm going to smooth a little bit on the mid lengths to ends. I'm going to try to keep some on the hand so that I can kind of get it near the scalp. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Now I have enough left. Now I hope I used enough. You never know until you try. Anything that's on the ends, I want to kind of squish up at the scalp. <laughs> Mush and squish, two of my favorite technical terms. After I got out of the shower, <clears throat> I kept the hair. <laughs> this is my fuzz. That's my fuzz. Yay. <laughs> That's a big ball of fur. 
And now we are moving on to the I Create Lift. Now they say to use one to two pumps. <sighs> Depends how long your hair is and how thick your hair is. I'm trying subscriber to use less. <laughs> what I am going to do, I'm gonna use two on one side and two on the other because I don't think two on my whole head is enough. My hair is longer now. It's not super thin, but it has enough, it has enough bulk to it that I think I just need more. And because I'm not used to using mousse or foam, I just, don't feel like there's enough stuff in my hair. I do believe I am going to do one pump in my top section here. I know. Is it too much? I don't know. But I just don't feel like mousse controls my hair enough. Yes, control freak. I'm going to flip and get the top. I got the top now, so I'm going to scrunch and I'm going to blow dry. And when we come back, we're gonna take a look at it and see how it turned out. Wow, wow, and more wow. Again, this is with the I Create Lift volumizing foam, so it wasn't anything heavy like the curl creams, but wow, take a look. It's very soft. So I really feel like I'm gonna frizz really quickly. Now I need to do the oil. Even though there's nothing to really de-crunchify. De we are going to use the I Create Shine, which is their shine oil. I don't think I need to flip and fluff. I'm very fluffy. And I really think all I'm gonna be doing is smoothing it. Well, that smells nice. Can you smell? <laughs> Very gently, over and under. I'm gonna do the same amount for the back. I'm only gonna do three for my lighter side because I have less hair there. And if you don't know why, go watch my videos. <laughs> Okay, wow and wow. Dare I flip and fluff? Do we try it? Will my hair fit in the screen if I flip and fluff? Let's try it, because now I'm curious. <laughs> wow, do we think I got more volume? Okay, my curlies, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Make sure everyone leaves a comment of some kind because it helps YouTube recommend me if you comment. So if you wouldn't mind, I appreciate it and I will respond. There we go with the InnerSense Organic Beauty line. Again, just a few of the other products that I didn't get a chance to try. And now I have, and I do like them. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up down below, please. Subscribe if you haven't. And don't forget, pass me around to everyone, even if they have straight hair, because either they know someone or they are straightening their hair and they are uh, a curly. Show them my videos. Maybe we'll get them to start embracing their curls. I'm going to leave my Instagram and my Facebook down below, so feel free to connect with me on there as well. Until next week, my curlies, ciao for now. We are trying, I am trying. Now a couple of the ingredients that are inside the sea, inside, this extract is high in potassium, magnesium, copper, and, and calcium. The sage helps provide more nourishment to the hair follicles. New nutrition, more nutrition. It's full of antibacterial, 
anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, and antioxidant properties. Benefits. Really? It's full of antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, and antioxidant benefits. Is It has the apple fruit, apple fruit, super helpful in repairing damage to it also helps reduce, it also helps with dry, it also helps with dry flaky scalps. Is I am in harmony with the flow of life. I am in harmony with the flow of life, yes. Now that I am sufficiently wet. <laughs> yeah. Can you see all of that? Look, ooh, it's alive. <laughs> oh, and it has fuzz in it. Remove the fuzz. So yes, and now we are moving on to the I Create Lift, and I can't open it because my hands are slippery. Yay. We still have oil. Maybe I'll have to add on to the video to make it more fun. <laughs> it's a great place to cut my hair from. Okay. Oh, hello. We have to... <laughs> What's happening? can't deal with you right now. Okay. It is now 4.06 on a Saturday. You know what that means. Yeah, you know. Even on a Saturday. <laughs> 